Senus, known in Roman mythology as Senus, was originally a woman named Canis who was transformed into a man by the sea god Poseidon. According to the Greek mythographer Apollodorus, an Ascoliast on the Iliad, Poseidon had sex with her, and afterward she asked him to turn her into an invincible man, Poseidon granted her wish. The story of Senus is a fascinating and unique one in Greek mythology. Senus, originally a woman named Canis, was a mortal who gained immortality and invulnerability through a transformation by the sea god Poseidon. This transformation from female to male is a significant aspect of the Senus myth, and it raises questions about gender identity and the fluidity of gender roles in ancient mythology. The story of Senus begins with her original identity as a woman named Canis. She was known for her beauty and her close association with the sea god Poseidon. According to the mythographer Apollodorus, Poseidon took a liking to Canis and had sexual relations with her. After their encounter, Canis asked Poseidon to grant her a wish, and she requested to be transformed into an invincible man. Poseidon granted her wish, and Canis was transformed into the male warrior Senus. As Senus, the former woman became known for his incredible strength and invulnerability. He became a fierce warrior and fought in the famous battle between the Lapiths and the Centaurs. Senus' invulnerability made him an unstoppable force on the battlefield, and he was able to defeat many of his enemies with ease. However, his invulnerability also became a source of jealousy and resentment from the other warriors, who saw him as an unnatural and unfair advantage in battle. The story of Senus' transformation and his subsequent exploits as a male warrior has been the subject of much interpretation and analysis by scholars and historians. The transformation from female to male is a central theme in the Senus myth, and it has been seen as a symbol of empowerment and liberation. Senus' transformation allowed him to escape the limitations and vulnerabilities of his original female identity, and it enabled him to assert his strength and power in a male-dominated world.